What's going on YouTube? It's Gadang775, just a my boy in Texas, back with another video. Today I'll be doing a review on the Archmage wireless over-the-ear Bluetooth headphones. And these are sporting Bluetooth 4.2, which is fantastic. It's pretty much the latest and greatest. Um, not too many Bluetooth 5.0 stuff, so I wouldn't expect expect that. But Bluetooth 4.2 is pretty much the standard, like the standard as of right now. And it does get a pretty good solid range, especially down my hallway. I marked my hallway from my living room to my hallway, and it gets to 30 feet easily. No breaks whatsoever. I go a little bit more to 33 feet very very minor chop it's only when I get to like 35 feet and beyond that's when these things start cutting out quite a bit but other than that these are fantastic when range now that's line of sight now if I go down 25 feet down my hallway and go into my my daughter's room it'll start to chop just a little not as bad as like a Bluetooth 4.0 and whatnot or like my like these idea USA's um, they'll start to chop at 25 feet. That's if you, you know, go out of sight. You know, go. I go into my daughter's room. You know, with the walls and stuff blocking the way. But range is great. Now, the most important thing I think sound quality is fantastic. Okay, for fifty dollars, forty nine ninety nine. Okay, I'll leave a link down below to to Amazon. And full disclosure, by the way, this was a review product that was sent to me. Okay, so I didn't, I didn't pay, I didn't pay for it. So this was sent to me to test. So I just full disclosure I'll, out of the bat. You know, I'm just letting you folks know. But you folks know I do a lot. I buy a lot of these products, and this sits up there with the rest of them. Okay, this one is actually comes fairly close to my Bluetio F2s up there, my Face 2s, that which are right now is tied with my <laughs> most favorite wireless over the headphones with. And the other one being SoundWiz, okay, SoundWiz open back, semi open back wireless headphones. These are pretty close, okay. These are really good, and I think these came out this year. The mids, the highs, they're crystal clear. The bass, this has got good bass, okay. Price per performance for 50 bucks. This is what you should expect to get when you're buying a pair of headphones in this price range, okay. That's what I think. The standard should be an Archmage hit it out of the park, right out of the park. First, first try out. I think this is their first pair. Oh, but yeah. Let me go ahead and play some sample music for you. Like I said, mids, highs, they're crystal clear. At full volume, it doesn't distort. It's very nice. It doesn't get tingy as well. You know, at really high volumes. Pretty good, huh? They're pretty good, right? They're fantastic, okay? Um, build quality? Build quality is actually pretty durable. Like this part right here, this is aluminum. I'm assuming this is aluminum. I could be wrong, but aluminum with plastic on the sides. This part is um, plastic right there, part of the cup. Um, the leather, um, I don't know, I'm pretty sure these are leather, but these are nice. The ear cups are fantastic. They're comfortable. Okay, again, I fell asleep with these overnight listening to my um, meditation music. I got meditation music I listen to at night. And it, if I can fall asleep with these on, any type of headphone that I can fall asleep with that doesn't bother me, it's a good pair. That means they're comfortable, and these are comfortable. Now, depending on the size, that's subjective, especially how depends on how big your head is or how small your head is so for me it's perfect it fits fine and this this headband right here it sits nice and comfortably on top of your head and this is very nice and soft as well now the one feature that I think stands out when these headphones is the battery life oh and the lossless APAT TX technology that's all built in there Bluetooth 4.2 and whatnot but the battery life I have to get I have to say that the battery life is fantastic. Now I got these on Tuesday and it's now Saturday. I charged it for three to four hours when I first got it to make sure it had enough juice. Then I pulled pulled it off the charger. I'm pretty sure it was already charged or it had had some juice already because ever since Tuesday I haven't put it back on the charger yet. And I must have tested these out for a good 20 hours over the past few days, at least 20 hours. One I fell asleep with them overnight. 
and the, over the past few days I had them on my ears um, when I when I go driving you know when I go do my errands or not I have these on my ear when I went shopping to at HEB I would have these things on my ears okay so I use this for a good 20 hours and the battery is still there it's still kicking okay at full full volume mind you I like to listen to stuff very loud but I like really nice loud clean sound and this fits the bill for forty nine ninety nine. I can't I, I can't stop smiling these are fantastic for what you pay for and I think again these are the standards of what every pair of fifty dollar headphones should be Archmage hit it out of the park uh, that's just my opinion now if you folks want to go ahead and take a look at this item I'll leave a link down below in the about section go ahead and check it out it's on Amazon I'm pretty sure <coughs> Excuse me, <laughs> I'm almost burped. But yeah, you can get this on Amazon. So again, the link is down below. I hope you folks check these out. And if you did pick these up, let me know what you think in the comments down below. All right. But yeah, it's Gdang775, just a my boy in Texas. If you folks like this video, hit that like button to subscribe to my channel for more videos every few days. If you didn't like this video, hit that dislike button. Let me know in the comments down below. I do appreciate the criticism. Skadang775, thanks for watching. Peace out.